Yep, that's me, trying to make a beer-infused hot sauce with the kid Olivia got me. I do feel like a mad scientist. <laughs> All right, so here we go. Olivia got me something that I can make fully, totally from scratch. <laughs> I thought it was a cool idea. I was very thoughtful. Yeah. It's a thoughtful DIY kit. Thoughtfully dry is what I kept saying. <laughs> but yes, it's thoughtfully DIY. And... Who wants chocolates for Valentine's Day? I got you a thing to make your own hot sauce. Perfect, perfect. But you could have bought me one with beer. <laughs> and I wouldn't have to do the work. <laughs> now we got to do a bunch of work. But let's see what chilies are inside of this hot sauce, shall we? Okay, so we have dried red cayenne peppers, dried chipotle peppers, dried gulilio peppers. Gulilio. <laughs> I want to look that one up. <laughs> Ancho pepper powder and New Mexico chili pepper powder. So it also includes two sets of gloves, two funnels, two bottles, and a recipe card. Okay, we got everything laid out here. I think I know what I'm doing. And when I say I think I know what I'm doing, I mean I absolutely have no idea what I'm doing. Uh, we got the instructions here. We're going to read them and uh, we're going to figure out what's going on. Actually, Olivia's going to read them because I can't see nothing right now. Literally, nothing. Okay, so it says to prepare beer infused hot peppers, 12 ounce American lager. Check. Two... Giuliano peppers, two chipotle peppers. You know what? Wait, just, just stop. I'm just gonna do it our way. We're not, we're not measuring anything around here. And when I mean we're not measuring anything, I mean we're not measuring anything. <laughs> All we gotta do, we're gonna add some peppers into each bottle. We're gonna fill them up. We're gonna let it sit for ten days, and then we're gonna boil it, right? Boil yeah. it, and then we're gonna. Olivia's going to try some. Be the first to try wait, some. Wait, it says once it's confused, it confused, uh, infused, then you put it in a blender and you can add additional ingredients to it for taste. And then you blend it and then boil it. Yeah. But and Olivia make... will be the first to try. Aaron, look at the mess you're making. It's fine. I think that's what the... Aaron, you're getting it on the floor. It's not fine. Oh my god. I just don't understand what you're doing though. Do you even know? Nope. What ones are those? Do we use Dried chipotle. Quick, Olivia, what's a chipotle pepper? Dried chipotle. Uh, a red. Jalapeno? <laughs> is it? Yeah. I was right. I didn't think about that. I was we'll gonna put say a couple it's of nice these chili. in. Aaron, you dropped one. <laughs> Do you think it's hot to eat? <laughs> I don't know how your mother raised you making a mess. the seeds. I wonder if you can plant them. There's a lot of seeds. What are those peppers? These are the dried cayenne. I'm just putting a bunch of everything in. Well, did you want to add some reefers? <laughs> This is where I'll need the funnel for this powder. Oh yeah, what kind of powder is that again? New Mexico chili powder. Oh yeah. We 
Make sure you say you split it half and half. I mean, I don't even think you're supposed to do that. I think you're overdoing it or something. Well, you're gonna be the first one to try it. Probably be the worst tasting <laughs> hot sauce ever. Well, you're trying it first, so. I'm right. <coughs> it's choking me. What's that? Ancho pepper. Mm. Oh. I didn't really see it said to do that right now. It sort of didn't. Yes, it does. <laughs> it says guana. <coughs> oh, wait. It, oh. Is, it is choking me. By my calculations, and when I say calculations, I mean I have no idea what the hell I'm doing. <laughs> it doesn't even say to put that in here. I like. Now we add the beer. We're going to let it sit for 10 days. Then we're going to boil it. And Olivia's going to put it on her food. Oh, it's up my nose, Aaron. <clears throat> we got Olivia's favorite lager. Yeah. Go slow or it's going to overflow. We'll do this. Okay, whoa, don't you know whoa, how to whoa, pour? Whoa, whoa, whoa. Don't you know how to pour a beer, man? Don't you? Oh my god, I'm dying in here. <coughs> I know it's choking me. <laughs> you know what? I knew this would happen. What? We need more beer. To the beer store. <coughs> Aaron, you're killing us. This was your gift. <laughs> what did you get me? Here you go. Yeah, I should have known you were going to make a mess. I don't even need the funnel. I do feel like a mad scientist. <laughs> <laughs> We gotta go full beers, man. And they are. I think it's got my nose running. Mine too. It's <laughs> up my nose. It's probably all on my clothes and everything. Alright, I think we're good. I just wanna get it. It's good. There's no room, Aaron. Look what you did. You don't listen. This one just needs a bit more. Yep, that's what I thought. I'm getting out of here. You're annoying the heck out of me. I'm not buying you nothing like that ever again, I'll tell you that. Okay, then we clean the tops off so we get a perfect seal. Oh, does it say that somewhere? Because most people aren't going to overflow it like that. Then you want to pop your top back on. Give them a shake. No, no shaking. No. We're gonna let them sit for 10 days. <laughs> we're gonna let them sit for 10 days and then we're gonna boil it and we're gonna try it. <laughs>